my piece has a slightly different tone. <laughs> than, than it's even more depressing. <laughs> so uh, this is a piece that I wrote earlier today. Uh, I was I was thinking about the theme of new frontiers, and um, you know, one thing I thought about and uh, what this scene is about is the first astronauts landing on Mars, and. Uh, I wrote it as a, a dialogue, like a scene for stage, um, but there's two characters, and I'm going to read them both in the same voice, which is my voice, <laughs> because I'm not an actor, but hopefully you guys will be able to figure out what's going on. I think you will. <laughs> this is it. In just a few minutes, we'll be the first humans ever to land on Mars. I can hardly contain my excitement. We're going to be celebrities. We'll be remembered forever. What a legacy. They'll probably build a monu monument to me in my hometown. And I'll have a school named after me. And all the kids from the school will take a field trip to visit the monument. And they'll probably make an iPhone app based on me, too. <laughs> you know what I'd like? Christopher Columbus has his own holiday. I'd like a day named after me, too. Hopefully a Wednesday. <laughs> Wednesday? Why not a Monday or a Friday? That's so cliche. Well, I'm not giving the kids from my school a Wednesday off for you. <laughs> You'll be dead. Oh, that's true. All right, well, we should probably make a plan for what to do once we land on Mars, seeing as how it's happening in a few minutes and we haven't thought about it at all yet. Good idea. I figure I'll step out first, and then you bring the flag. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> You'll step out first? Yeah, you know, to make sure there's no Martian ambush. Uh, how about I step out first? Martian ambush is a risk I'm willing to take. Look, I need to step out first. I need this legacy. Everyone remembers Neil Armstrong, but no one remembers the second guy to walk on the moon. It was Buzz Aldrin. People do remember that. People only remember that because his name was Buzz. <laughs> But your name is Buzz. So is yours. Yeah, my mom really wanted me to be an astronaut. <laughs> yeah, mine too. I know, that's why we make such a good team. Okay, Buzz, well, <laughs> how are we going to settle this? Let's just flip a coin, Buzz. Call it in the air. Heads. Oh, the coin is floating away. <laughs> Yes, it is. You'd think we would have realized that would happen, seeing as how we're both professional astronauts. <laughs> yeah, and since that's the third time today, we've unsuccessfully tried to flip a coin. <laughs> All right, well, I hate to do this, but I'm the commanding officer on this space shuttle, so if you don't let me go first, I'll make sure you never work in this town again. We're on Mars. That's not that big a deal. But you know what? I can tell you really want this, so why don't you go ahead? Awesome, thank you. Is there anything I can do for you in return? Yeah, you know, we've been on this shuttle for a year, and I'm pretty sick of eating this ice cream and drinking this tang. <laughs> when you get down on Mars, do you think you could pick me up, like, a Fiji water or something? <laughs> I don't think they're going to have Fiji water on Mars. Well, you know, if you see, like, a convenience store or something, or like a Martian Starbucks. <laughs> Starbucks is everywhere. <laughs> okay, I'll be on the lookout. Anyway, here I go. Wish me luck. Buzz stepped out of the space shuttle and was immediately killed in a Martian ambush. <laughs> <laughs>